Senior workers of the Nigeria Postal Service have picketed the Office of Minister of Finance over plans to cede the collection of stamp duty to the Federal Inland Revenue Service. TV News correspondent Jokia Adisa reports that Finance Minister Zainab Ahmed has now requested the workers to furnish her office with a position paper to be able to push their case before the National Committee on Tax Review. The recent tax review exercise carried out by the federal government is not going down well with these workers of the Nigeria Postal Service. The finance bill recently passed by the National Assembly is the cause of their worry. The bill seeks to rejuvenate Nigeria's tax collection system and proposes that FIRS be made to collect the stamp duty if that of the statutory responsibility of NIPOST. But the workers insist taking off stamp duty collection from NIPOST will render more than 10,000 of them jobless. Just as, are we saying that the Honorable Minister has a plan to take all revenue generating agencies, collapse them and send everybody, send their responsibility to inland revenue so that these people will have no more job? From the press conference, the workers proceeded to the Federal Ministry of Finance to register their displeasure. The Minister of Finance, accompanied by the Permanent Secretary and the Information and Culture Minister, addresses the workers. The major interest is to enhance revenue. Because we need to do that to move our, federal, uh, our federation forward. Our revenues have been underperforming specifically list time duties because of litigation between two government agencies. Mrs. Hamid wants the workers to present to our office a position paper to be tabled before the National Tax Review Committee for a likely review. I want a documented case that I can use to escalate the case that you're making. She has assured us that the matter is not foreclosed and that is open to further discussion and deliberation. Yes. And she has requested for a position paper from the union, uh, which we have promised to give to her before the close of work tomorrow. So after that, whatever happens thereafter, is what we determine whether we can still continue to trust them. The address by the finance minister to the aggrieved workers of Naples seems like the soothing balm that they need to give them hope that the service's constitutional responsibility of stamp duty collection will not be taken away from them anytime soon. Jokers, TVC News, Abuja.